Hi there, thank you for watching this clip on finding arc length. The easiest way to think arc length is that it's related to the perimeter. We know that perimeter of a circle is 2 pi times the radius. Okay, so instead of memorizing any formula that teacher might throw at you or a textbook might throw at you, well, you can think of this as a ratio. Perimeter is for 360 degrees of arc length. So whatever arc length we're finding, or let's call this L, okay, that's equal to the degrees you're giving, which is 90 degrees for us, for any theta, as a matter of fact, is going to equal to 2 pi r over 360. Now in our case, it's really easy because 90 is quarter of 360 degrees. But let's walk through it and see what we can use to find a general case. What I'm doing here is I draw a butterfly. This is the quickest way to get out of a fraction with the equation. So basically it says L times uh, 360 cross multiply is equal to 90 times 2 pi r. And in order to find L, I'm going to divide. So 90 over 360, thus my quarter over here is 2 pi times r, which is 16 centimeters. So a quarter times 2 times pi times 16. 16 and this cancel, that's 4, so I have 8 pi in a centimeter. In order to round it off, I have pi equal to 3.14159. That's rounded to the nearest tenth times 8. And I am going to reach over for my calculator. Uh, 3.14 times 8, I have 25.12 centimeters. So this is approximately 25.12 centimeters. So this is how we handle our length. Hope it's clear. Please share your comments with me on YouTube and vote like if you find this video helpful. Thank you. Till next time, have a confident day.